Okay. Well, thank you all for coming out tonight. Don't forget when you're driving home tonight to take your car. And um, here's the cabin of death. You all already know the cabin of death, right? Yes. Is there anybody here that doesn't know the cabin of death? One, two? Oh, come on. You've heard the cabin of death. I wrote this a long time ago. I wanted to write the perfect bluegrass song, and uh, so I did. Um, it was easy. I got to thinking about what the perfect bluegrass song would have to be, and the best bluegrass songs are always about a cabin. I mean, you know bluegrass music is music that's sung from the heart, through the nose. Um, it's happy, upbeat-sounding music with miserable, depressing lyrics. So uh, this one has all of that. It had to be about a cabin, so I wrote it about a cabin. Somebody had to live in the cabin, mom, dad, little sister, so I included them in the song. And for the miserable, depressing part, somebody had to die. So it's called The Cabin of Death. Well, mom, dad, they died up in our cabin. The little sister's in there dying too. We'll bury her out back behind the cabin. We'll save a spot beside for me and you. Now everybody's dying in our cabin. We all thought that it was just the flu. Turns out it was something really different. Now it's even killing me and you. Sister Sue, he said he'd never seen anything quite like it. Look out back, he's buried out there too. Now everybody's dying in our cabin. We all thought that it was just the flu. Turns out it was something really different. Now it's even killing me and you. Now, I thought that was enough. I wrote three chords and almost everybody's dead. And the MC at this bluegrass festival where I was playing one time came up afterward and he said, Ned, I like your song, but I think it needs a third verse, something to tie everything together. I don't know, kill everybody off. I'm not sure what his point was, but the MC at this festival also happened to be the guy who owned the record company that my old band used to record for. So uh, I figured I'd write him this third verse. He likes it. You know, I get a recording contract kind of thing out of it. You know where I'm going with this, don't you? Well, you might notice I mentioned he owned the record company we used to record for. We never made another record after that, but I did write him a third verse and put it on my own record. And uh, it has two essential bluegrass elements that I left out before, and I'll show what they, what they are when I get to them. And on the last chorus, y'all can sing along with me, if you will. Uh, the chords are, the words are easy. I'll tell you what they are, and if you get them wrong, it's the cabin of death. It, it'll be fine. If you should ever go out to our cabin, up along the pine trees on the hill, you'll find a rusty shovel in the graveyard. Dig a hole when you start feeling ill. Now Flu. We all thought that it was just the flu. Turns out it was something really different. Turns out it was something. Now it's even killing me and you. Now it's even killing me and you. Now it's even killing me and you.